Good morning and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today is Sunday and normally it is not a mail day but my post office has extended hours for Christmas and I missed the post office by half an hour yesterday so I knew I had a package waiting for me. Um, it must have came in after I had already checked the mail on Friday so the, the slip was there on Saturday but I didn't get to pick it up until this morning. I went first thing at 9. To, as soon as it opened to grab my package. I was thinking it was gonna be something different than what it was. It's actually my Black Friday order from Fashion Nova. So I've never ordered from them before. I've never ordered, hot. Um, I've never ordered any lingerie, no clothing, no anything. So this is my very, very first order from them. And I kind of, I already ripped it open a little bit, but I haven't opened the pieces. So I ended up getting Okay, so I ordered five things from them. Most of it is lingerie, but I did see that I've ordered one swimsuit. It's on, I honestly feels like it's been so long, I don't even know what I ordered. So let's look at it together. Okay, so everything is in their own individual little plastic bag. Oh, I love the color on this. And everything I bought was in size small, so this is a little one piece bodysuit in an army green. It has adjustable straps and snaps. Three snaps down at the crotch that are adjustable. There's a couple of different um, spots you can put them. And then it is double lined on the cups, even though they are somewhat see-through. And then the body is see-through as well as the back. And then besides that, it just has the tag. This is called the Somebody to Love Lace Teddy. Again, it is in size small. So there is the first one. It does have the underwire. I'm curious to see how their smalls run because like I said, I've never bought anything from them before. Second item I bought is, I don't even know. Um, <laughs> okay. <laughs> is a romper this looks ginormous i'm not gonna lie this is again a oh i guess it's a small medium is the problem so i don't know whether this is gonna work for me it's completely see-through it's just lace it's really soft it does have adjustable straps so we will see if i adjust them all the way up if i can make this work um all of the lingerie is non-refundable so I might be stuck with this no, I'm definitely stuck with this <laughs> but hopefully it fits better than what it looks right now I'm not feeling too hopeful okay so I tighten those straps as tight as I possibly could Let's tag on here this is called baby lust lace teddy and I will let you know once I try it on whether I recommend it or not. So it does crisscross in the back. It's a little bit, it's kind of like short, it's a little bit. So we will see, the color is really cute. The lace is super soft. There's not much to it. And I know I didn't pay a whole lot. So it is size small, medium. We will see if small, medium can work for me. Next up, we have a two-piece set. So this one is in turquoise, or turquoise, oh my gosh, burgundy. And it does have the eye hooks on the back in three different um, sizes so you can choose. And again, the straps are adjustable. These ones, it seems like everything is adjusted like as big as it can possibly go. It's got these cute little gold details here on the straps, one on either side, and then it has this um, kind of like embroidery here, and it is double lined. The color is really cute. It is, well, I guess it's not called anything. <laughs> Let's see about the bottoms. I can't tell you what the name is. I'll have to look it up, but here's the bottoms. The bottoms look reasonable, not too big, not too small. There's no adjustability, there's just elastic, and I see that it's double elastic, so one is obviously just 
for decoration and the other one's actually a strap. So it's a thong and it's completely lined with the little embroidery and then the matching details. These are not hooks or anything, they don't open, they're just for, just for looks. So next up we have this bright pink one. So I actually don't have that many pink pieces if, and you would know that if you watch my closet try on hauls, I feel like I just don't really have a lot of pink. I have a lot of red, a lot of black and a lot of blue. And you can all go watch all of those other videos if you want to see what all I have in my closet. But pink and purple were actually very limited. So I grabbed oh, this one. I think this is hopelessly romantic teddy. I think this might be the same as the first one or pretty darn close. Okay, so it is size small. Again, it looks fairly large. On I don't know, <laughs> we'll see. It does have underwires and it is adjustable in the straps. Again, these are loosened like as much as they can be. And then it does have this additional strap on the back. You can't, oh, actually you can unhook it to get yourself in and then you can tighten it if it's too loose. So. We will see, it also has a lined crotch and snaps down here, but they're not adjustable, it's just one size. Overall, obviously I picked it because I really liked it. So we will see what it looks like on, I'm not gonna lie. All of these pieces look insanely big. So I'm hoping that at least a couple of them work because like I said, I can't set them back. <laughs> okay, and last but not least, is a bikini so it is turquoise or teal whatever you want to call it and it has some little straps over here on the side not adjustable or anything just cute they're a little bit cheeky more along the lines of full bottoms the quality seems really good they are lined on the inside they're really really soft so and let's see what I picked for a top. I honestly don't even remember what I ordered. I have no idea. Okay. I don't even know. Okay. This has a lot, a lot of straps going on. Okay. Let's try to pick it up. Okay, so it has all of these straps here and then they cross in the back and I'm assuming when you put it on they will spread out a little bit to give a design. This does have a little bit of light padding on the inside and it does look like those are removable and it'll have to go over your head. Oh my gosh, I'm never going to get this on. <laughs> okay, so it goes over your head. It is not adjustable here. There's no hook or anything so you have to kind of maneuver your way in around all of these tangle of straps I don't know I'm honestly not I'm liking the pieces but I don't feel overly optimistic about these and if that's the case either I ordered too big and maybe I should have ordered the extra smalls but I'm not an extra small in most sites so I didn't want to order extra small and, um, and then everything be too small but I guess the yeah flip side is ordering everything too large and everything being too big. Either way, I think the bikini is the only thing that's returnable if it doesn't work, but we will see. Let me try this stuff on for you and we will decide together whether it was worth the money or not worth the money. And I will also find out what I paid for everything so we can also check the prices. So stay tuned. I have the army green one. It fits okay. I tightened up the straps quite a bit. It is sewn a little funny here. It kind of looks like nipples, but it's not. It's just the sewing of it. Besides that, it's pretty cute. And it fits really good. I said it was a little bit. I still am skeptical of this try on order. But I don't think I paid too much considering I got everything from Black Friday. Just so far, these weird little shapes. I don't know if I, even if I pull it really tight, it's still just so weird. Like I have my pasties on and it's not 
not nipples, but there they are. <laughs> Two weird sewn spots. But I really like the color. It's pretty comfortable. Hopefully when I use it for pictures, you won't be able to notice the sewing is a little weird. Check it. My two weird little sewing spots. <laughs> but besides that, I like it. This one, this was the one I was really skeptical about. I did tighten the straps as much as they could possibly go. It is a little bit weird here. I don't know. I think overall from the front, it looks pretty cute. And then from the back, it crisscrosses here. And then there's no other adjustability, but it is a little bit, I don't know, not too form fitting. This one is the size small, medium. So I think I would be able to make it work. Do I love it? No, I do not. <laughs> but you never know unless you buy and try. So, so far, um, they're only okay. I'm not super thrilled. Okay, we're getting there. This is next up, the two-piece burgundy set. The cups are a little on the large side, but, and I again had to tighten the straps a ton. This is both a size small. Um, but I do like the color and the fit. And I'm hoping maybe if I throw the bra in the dryer, maybe it will kind of shrink down a tiny bit. I know this is all here making it look a little bit bigger than what it is. That's just the applique, like the embroidery part. The cup is actually kind of underneath all of that. But I do like the color. I don't have anything quite like this. I have stuff that's more on the red side. This is a little bit more on the purple side. So I think it does look cute. It'll definitely work for some pictures. And maybe next time I will just try their extra small stuff. Let's see what happens. Okay, next up we have this one. It is a very small in the front. I think that the back is bigger. I do not love the fit of this. I feel like I had to tighten the straps so much that it pulled the cups up really, really high. Um, the color is cute. That's about it. It's the bikini. The bikini fits really cute, actually. I'm pretty happy with this one. This is how the top looks when it's actually on. It was really hard to show with all these straps kind of going everywhere when it wasn't on. And then again, it still has these straps down here on the side. So there's like six of them. So this one's pretty cute. It has no adjustability around the bust area, but it does fit okay. It doesn't feel like it's too loose. It doesn't feel like it's too tight. And of course I always leave the cups in. So that's it for my Fashion Nova try on haul. Overall, I'm not thrilled. I didn't love it. Um, would I order from them again? Honestly, probably not, just because I don't want to take the risk and then the fact that there's no returns. Um, the price points are higher than like Shein and Zoffel and stuff like that. So when I'm like, oh, you know, this outfit doesn't look good, but I only paid $10 for it versus, oh, that outfit doesn't look good, I paid 25 or 30. So um, I just don't feel like it is worth the risk. Although it did come first, I ordered everything on the same day. I'll give them that. They had fast shipping, fast-ish shipping. They were the first of my Black Friday orders to arrive, so I will give them that. But overall, I didn't love what I got, 
and like I said, I probably won't risk it again. So this is definitely a one of one try on all. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed it. Comment down below and tell me what one was your favorite. I know there wasn't a lot to choose from. I would say my favorite was probably the bikini. It's the one that I felt fit the best. And on to the next try on haul. We've still got lounge coming in. That's coming in from the UK, so that's gonna be a bit. Um, I've got this summer bikinis coming in and also Yandy, a huge, huge Yandy order that I think I'm gonna split into three parts. So lots more goodies to try on and hopefully they won't all be a best leg like fashion of it. But thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And as always, you can follow me on Instagram at Krista underscore T and also on OnlyFans at Krista underscore T where we don't have to worry about the fit of clothes because I'm not wearing any. See you in my next video.